Jal, uh, a comfortable 5-1 win over Stratford Town in the FA Trophy first round. You must be uh, really happy with today's work. Yeah, um, today wasn't about us. We, I suppose we had everything to, to lose and nothing to gain, really, um, unless we unless we progressed. So today was about, like I said, about, about Stratford. They've done fantastic to get to to this level, if you like, and this um, stage of the competition. And um, I thought they were a credit to their league, did themselves proud, did their, their management team proud, and kept going. Um, as much as we're disappointed to, con- to concede um, when teams put that much effort in, I think it's was was deserved on their on their part, um, but from us, like I say, it was just about getting the job done, being professional in what we did in, in horrible conditions, um, and we're into the next round and we'll see what um, what joys we have whenever the draw is. If it's if it's Monday, we'll see where we stand. Uh, after the disappointment of last week at Dover, I said it was it, how how key was it to uh, to get a goal early and to really establish our dominance, make sure that there's no um, no room for error. It's always good to score early because it, again, I think when um, when a, t- a team from a, a lower division comes to a, a higher division club, just as we would be if we were playing someone from a higher level, it's about starting well first and foremost, and then potentially trying to stay in the game. Um, so we'd spoken about starting at a, a high intensity and, and trying to win the game in the first in the first half. As it turns out, we we, we did that more through errors on, on their part um, because in general play they were, like I say, they were organised they got men behind the ball, they were resolute and um, and, and we found it difficult to create in open play, um, but to get the goals we did um, really the game was was over at half time, it was then a case of us being, being professional and, and doing the right things um, which in the main we did um, like I say, in, in, in difficult conditions that really um, never spoilt the game as a spectacle, but made it really, really difficult to play in the way we want to play. Uh, in the last few years, you've used this competition as a, a bit of a platform for players on the fringes to, to prove themselves worthy of a place in the first 11. Uh, do you feel the players that maybe applied to them today, maybe like Tom Brew at um, Tazdemir, Tazdemir um, and a few others, that, that they did that? It's always hard because, uh, again, Lads, every lad that played there will think and say they should be playing week in, week out. It's 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 recognising when to give people opportunities and them taking them, um, and not being willy nilly and making changes for changes' sake. Um, these games are always going to be difficult, like I say, because I suppose the players who've gone out there have got, in some instances, nothing to gain, nothing to lose because they're expected to go and win, and if they don't and they don't perform to the levels we expect from them then it probably puts them a little bit further behind so as much as lads had opportunities um, I, I think the, the team for Ebbsfleet will be picked with a like I say with an open mind not based on, on today's game in any in any way um, it'll be more around things that have gone on over the last two weeks since the since the Dover game um, and we look to like I say perform again here and, and get back to winning ways in the league okay thanks John cheers, cheers.